Welcome to another Invisible Wheelchair Podcast Tapping Recording. In this recording, I'm going to take you through a simple tapping session related to the podcast you just listened to. This is a simple tapping session as a starter to your tapping journey. This is not meant to be a full tapping session, but a starter that you can build on as you do more tapping and more of what your spirit needs to tap on comes out. If you have not tapped before and don't know or understand emotional freedom techniques, better known as tapping, then I suggest you go to FocusedHealthyFamily.com or FamilyOCD.com. Go to the About EFT page to find out more about how to tap and the tapping process before you begin this recording. This recording will not go over those details about how to do EFT or tapping. What I'm going to do is say a phrase, give you a space to repeat that phrase as we continue to tap. I will for myself start at the point above the eyes at the eyebrow and move to each point with each phrase or word that I use. I will not say the point name during this tapping recording. Remember again, if you have not tapped before, then please go to FocusedHealthyFamily.com or FamilyOCD.com and go to the About EFT page to find out more about it. Make sure to keep breathing normally. Keep hydrated. Drink plenty of water as you tap. And most of all, be conscious of what thoughts come up during your tapping. I call these pop-ups. They can be words, phrases, songs, pictures, or feelings. These could be very important messages from your mind as to what needs to be worked on, so you may want to write them down and add those pop-ups to your future tapping sessions. I would not brush them off lightly, no matter if they don't match what you're immediately tapping on. The mind does not bring them up lightly. So, let's begin now. This is the tapping recording for Podcast 9, called Will They Call DSS? I'd like to start this tapping process out with taking a deep breath. So let's do that now. Now I'm going to start the tapping process above the eye and I'm going to move to each point as I move from one statement to the next. Let's begin. I am worried about what others think. I am worried about what others see. I am really worried someone will turn us in. I'm afraid they're going to find out. What if they find out and we have problems? Are they going to be mean? Are they going to call the authorities? Will I lose the person I care for? What will happen? My neighbors have never been mean before. Whatever happens, I can handle it. I have handled tough situations before. We have had a lot of tough situations. We are still here. My mind is running wild with bad ideas. It is running on fear and exhaustion. I am so tired that I'm imagining the worst. My neighbors are nice people. 
I understand my mind is trying to protect me. Because it is working from fear. I am ready to stop the fear. Fear is just false evidence appearing real. I am ready to relax and release the fear. When I release fear, I can think calmly. That allows my mind to relax and drop the fear. I am ready for that. I am ready to treat my child with love and compassion. I am ready to treat myself with love and compassion. I am ready to treat all in my family with love and compassion. Even though things may get rough, I know I can stay calm. I will treat it with love and compassion. I will treat my child with love and compassion. I will treat my family with love and compassion. I will treat myself with love and compassion. I am ready to treat myself with love and compassion now. All right, let's take a deep breath. I know that was a, some simple phrases, but I hope you can go over them a couple of times and then be very open in your mind as to what comes out from those phrases. What does your mind say about them? Is there resistance in there? If there's resistance, what is it saying? And what is it saying about you? So as you hear these resistance, the more you do this tapping, be open to tapping around those resistance and find out what this is really about. Do these tappings every day and be very open to what's going on in the mind, the real messages that are back there that will help you to overcome them instead of just pushing them back down. So remember, keep tapping, talking, and transcending your life into new heights. Thank you for tapping and keep tapping and have a great day.